Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, we are going to do A's level paper 22, October, November 2017. Control account question, that is question number 2. Question number two. Throat provided the following information. The year ended 30th April 2017. They are given sales ledger control account balance. Sales ledger balance. And they says the following arrays were identified. These are the errors given. Some errors are given. And what is the question? The question is, complete the following tables to update the sales ledger control account balance and sales ledger balance, individual sales balance. They are given both the sales ledger balance Sales ledger control account balance. This is a wrong balance. And given sales ledger balances. That also given. These are the wrong balances. We have to do the correction now. So let's do. First one. The sales journal total had been overcast by $30,420. Sales journal overcast means sales control account overcast. Total amount due is overcast. So what we have to do? We have to deduct this amount. We have to sales journal overcast means sales control account is overcasted so we have to deduct so put in the less column amount is 30,420 deduct now second one a dishonored check 9745 had been ended in the customer had not been ended in the customer's account it means there is a dishonored check dishonored check will increase the amount accounts receivable or trade receivables will Increase so it is not ended in the customer's account means it will go to the sales ledger account. It will go to the sales ledger. What is the amount? Nine thousand seven hundred forty-five. So sales ledger nine thousand seven hundred forty-five dishonored check. Dishonored check. Dishonored check. It will increase nine seven nine seven four five nine thousand seven hundred forty five. The first one was sales journal. Sales Thirty thousand four hundred twenty. We were changed the column. Now I just changed the column. Sales. Jail. So first two we are done. Then the third one. Third one. Interest charge on an overdue amount. 720 720 interest charge had been completely omitted from the books of account 
what it means it means they are not ended in the sales ledger control account or sales ledger interest charge interest will increase the trade receivable so we should add in both sales ledger control account and sales ledger account so interest the amount is 720 both sales ledger and sales control account we should do the interest amount Seven hundred twenty. Next, the sales return journal had been overcast by four thousand five hundred sixty dollar. Sales return journal means we enter in the sales ledger control account. So four thousand five hundred sixty. Always. we deduct sales return from sales ledger control account so this is overcast means more amount the business they have deducted so what we have to do we have to add back this amount to the sales ledger control account 4560 sales return Four thousand five hundred sixty. Next error. Discount allowed. One thousand five hundred twenty had been completely omitted from the books of account. Completely omitted means they are not ended in both sales ledger control account, sales ledger account. So discount allowed. Discount allowed. always the business enter with the payment so it decrease the trade receivables it goes to the credit side so always we deduct so we have to deduct 1520 both sales ledger control account and sales ledger account interest not interest discount allowed they were omitted now we enter discount allowed 1520 deduct completely omitted means we have to enter in both sales ledger control account and Sales ledger account discount allowed. Deduct one thousand five hundred twenty dollar. Next receipts from credit customers. Receipts from credit customers ended in the cash book had been overcast eighteen thousand nine hundred sixty five. received from credit customers this is decrease the sales ledger control account balance so it will affect only the sales ledger control account balance because it is overstated or overcast in cash book so sales ledger control account this amount we have to add it back the amount is 18965 the cash balance always reduce the sales ledger control account balance now they overcast means we have to add back this amount to the control account bank receipts What is the amount? Eighteen thousand nine hundred sixty-five. 
965. Next. An irrecoverable debt of 1825 had been written off in the sales ledger control account. Sales ledger control account already ended the irrecoverable or bad debt. But no entry had been made in the customer's account. It means we have to do the bad debt always reduce the customer's balance, sales ledger balance. So we have to enter only in the customer's account. In sales ledger control account, the amount is already ended. What is the amount? 1825 irrecoverable debt means we have to deduct irrecoverable debt 1825 now the net balance we have to do the balancing here total we add the net effect we have to add then the closing balance will be closing balance 85000 85,490. This is the correct balance. It means this amount we deducted. 30,420 we deducted. And 1,520 we deducted. This column, adding column, 720 added. 4,560 added. 18,965 also added. Then we got 85,490. Next, we have to check the sales ledger balance. It should be the same. So here, closing balance. Same amount, 85,490. We added 9,745 9, plus 720. We deducted 1,520 and again deducted 1,825. Then finally, we got the balance 85,490. Now, both sales ledger balance and sales control account balance is equal or same. Hope you are clear with the solution. If you are not subscribed my channel yet, please subscribe and continue watching. Thanks for watching.